Okay, let's talk about the tail bag. Why do we need a tail bag um, is what we're gonna cover, also the features of our tail bag. We're gonna assume you're already feeding biomane equipment pellets. So you've started the process of accelerating the growth and increasing the thickness of the tail. Now you've gotta maintain that tail and protect it. Really, essentially, you're protecting your investment. There's no point in feeding the product and growing that tail longer and thicker if you're just gonna let the weather elements damage the tail, let the swishing, um, in the warmer summer months, even in the winter months, uh, horses swish their tails. It's a natural thing for them. When that tail isn't protected with a tail bag, the tail itself is taking the blunt end of that, of that damage and that's what causes the thinning uh, and the breaking of the hair. So, we highly recommend using a tail bag. There's other tail bags out on the market. What we want to show you is the uh, specific features that we like about our tail bag. Uh, we feel the length is good. Um, it attaches just below the tailbone and so that keeps it on majority of you know all horses other than ponies it keeps it up off the ground that's the main point uh, you're going to want to attach it just below the tailbone and keep it as high off the ground uh, as possible if a horse has a tail that drags the ground which many of us have um, from feeding the product that tail is going to go in the tail bag you're just going to loop it back up there's no problem with that it will all tails will fit in this tail bag features that we like like i said the length we like we've Included these whippers, just really as, as a feature for keeping flies off. Um, it's, it's similar to what the horse's tail does on its own. Um, other features that we like, the double Velcro. What this allows us to do is essentially lock it there on the tail. A concern some people have is, well, if for some reason this gets caught or hung up or stepped on, um, and rips, I'm gonna rip that whole tail out because that double Velcro feature is gonna essentially not come undone, it's gonna rip the horse's tail off. That's not the case. Um, in any tail bags that have ripped off, um, the seams on these Velcros, uh, Velcro straps are what rips off. So you don't need to be concerned about the actual tail ripping out. If any feature on this tail bag is to rip, it's the seams. If that happens, get a hold of us, we'll send you another tail bag or just sew it back on. We've sewn a lot of our own tail bags back on, no problems. Uh, we wanted to use a really good, durable, but lightweight material. We don't want a lot of weight hanging on that tail, causing that horse uh, any, any irritation, causing them to rub, uh, but we wanted something slick and durable. Uh, these tail bags, they just don't wear out. Uh, we've gone with an embroidery. Uh, reason being, it looks good. Um, we've screen printed some in the past, the swishing over time that that screen printing cracks, peels, falls off. So we went with a, with a, a nicer embroidery so everyone knows where you got your tail bag and that you love the Biomain product line. Hope this helps. <laughs>